Hello, welcome to NeoScribe. Let's face it, Boston Dynamics is the SpaceX of robotics, and if you're a fan of robotics like I am, you can't wait to see what they come up with next. But while we wait, let's check out some robots developed in Japan capable of doing amazing things. First is the HRP-5 developed by Japan's National Institute of Advanced Industrial Science and Technology, or AIST. The HRP-5 is the 8th generation robot from the Humanoid Robotics Project, which started in 1997 when AIST licensed Honda's patents from their P3 robot, and AIST built off of that technology. HRP is 1.8 meters tall, weighs 101 kilograms, and has 37 points of motion, counting both arms and legs. It has upgraded high-power motors with double the joint torque and speed from previous models, and is capable of creating a 3D map of the surrounding environment using an array of head sensors. Now look at this, the robot is capable of using power tools and completing simple construction tasks like hanging drywall. Look how incredible that is. Now, AIST plans to build off this technology and lay the groundwork for humanoid robots that can contribute to society and help compensate for Japan's shortage of workers. Now, I'd like to turn the spotlight to the University of Tokyo's Ishikawa Senu Lab, who developed the robot from the 2012 video that can win at rock, paper, scissors 100% of the time by recognizing the motion of the human hand in one millisecond. The Senu Lab aims to develop robotics technology that can pioneer high performance and high functionality applications. While Boston Dynamics focuses on advancing locomotion, Sanu Lab focuses on fine motor skills by focusing on three system factors of input, processing, and output that all must work in harmony. And over the years, Sanu has developed a long list of high-speed sensing and image processing systems. There's too many to discuss, but one example is their high-speed vision chip. The vision chip was developed with collaboration with Sony and it's capable of processing visual data allowing the system to detect, recognize, and track objects and provide visual feedback at high speeds. So with these systems, Senu robots are capable of doing amazing things. This is one of their projects from last year. This robot is able to throw balls and hit randomly placed targets and is capable of manipulating its fingers while throwing the ball in a similar way a baseball pitcher does, allowing it to throw the ball on target. And look here, the robot is able to adjust to the target that was moved midway and it still hit the target. That's pretty incredible. All right, now here, this is an older project from 2009 with two robots. One is pitching a ball and the other is striking a ball like a batter. Finally, this is their latest project, which was posted back in September. They created a robot that can quickly solve a Rubik's Cube with just three fingers, with incredible dexterity. The robot can process what it sees at a rate of 500 frames per second, as it analyzes the shape, position, angle, and center of gravity of the cube. And Senu plans to build off their research from these projects with the idea of having robots that can perform tasks that require extreme dexterity, such as assembling equipment or even robotic surgery. So robotics labs throughout Japan are working hard to develop robots that will someday help with the country's looming workforce shortage, and I can't wait to see what they come up with next. All right, that's all I have for now. I hope you enjoyed your journey. If you did, please leave a like and subscribe. I am Neil Scribe, and I'll see you on the next journey.